Hey, what's up you guys? Putting a hitch on your Scion XB can take you to some really fun places like camping, trail bike riding, kayaking. It can even tow a U-Haul trailer to just about anywhere in North America. Come on, let's go ahead and break down this really easy hitch install. You will need the tool seen here to complete this installation. Okay, so again, this is a really easy hitch install. We're right below the passenger side frame where the passenger side of the hitch is gonna attach to. It's got three weld nuts already in the frame here. One, two, and three, right above the exhaust. Um, again, on the driver's side, there's three holes here. One, two, three. The hitch does replace the tow loop here, so we'll drop that down, put the hitch up, and just bolt it right up. Um, if you do any, encounter any issues with your weld nuts being dirty, uh, corroded, please see um, our video on weld nut repair. Okay, let's get right to it. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and use a drill motor with a six inch extension and 17 millimeter socket. Um, that'll drop down our tow loop here. It's just two bolts. Okay, we'll go ahead and return this to the vehicle's owner. In case they ever take the hitch off, they can put it back up. Okay, so today I'm gonna to be using a exclusive U-Haul hitch jack to help me get the hitch into place. If you don't have a hitch jack, it's a good idea to get an extra set of hands. They can get a little heavy. Okay, and the, the six holes all line up pretty easily here. So um, now that the hitch is in place, we're just gonna take our provided hardware by the manufacturer, which is a conical tooth washer, has teeth on one end. That, that end will be contacting the hitch. And then we've got our bolt here that mates up with the threads on the weld nuts in the frame. Okay, we'll go ahead and do the same thing on the driver's side. Okay, now we'll go ahead and take our 19 millimeter socket and we'll just snug them up with the drill motor here. Okay, and you can see that our exhaust gets in the way a little bit, but the exhaust can move. It's just on hanger, so we'll just pull it over and snug it up. Okay, and we'll get our hitch jack out of the way, and our last step will be to torque it. Um, torque the bolts down to the manufactured specs. Okay, so we have our torque wrench here with our 19 millimeter socket, and we're just gonna go ahead and torque all six bolts down. Okay, and then over to the driver's side and do the same thing. Okay, and that's it for our hitch install. Um, it took us about a whole 10 minutes to do it, so um, pretty easy hitch. Let's go ahead and get it down on the ground and get it level so that we can give you some important measurements for selecting uh, ball mounts and accessories. Okay, now that we have the vehicle on level ground, let's get you your measurements. From the pinhole 
to the rear edge of the bumper here. It's going to be three and a half inches. And from the ground to the top of the receiver tube is going to be 13 inches. Um, you can see that we have a really nice square inch and a quarter receiver tube. The hitch is really well hidden. Um, and that's it. Pretty simple hitch. Um, enjoy the outdoors. Have fun and be safe. Thanks for watching our video. To learn more about the product seen in this video, or to schedule an installation by a U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.